most uh, people who will watch this video do, will not know um, who I'm talking about, who I'm referring to. Um, and if I had a way to privately uh, send this uh, video to who I am I want to intend it to be to, I would do so, but um, I can't. And so if you guys, um, just uh, other people who don't know who uh, SJD is, um, just go ahead and just uh, X out of this video because you won't know or understand uh, what I'm saying because this video is in response to something that SJD, uh, somebody I know, Stephen, um, a video that he just did. Um, so, uh, Stephen, I just seen, <clears throat> I just saw your video about your, the bike and the moped and things like that and how uh, somebody of, of color had done that to you. And I, um, and SJD, I want to let you know that this is exactly how the enemy works. He does things like this to traumatize. This has, he, he's been doing this for thousands and thousands of years. He traumatizes people through these experiences. And what it does is that if you hold on to it and harbor it, it makes your heart uh, cold. It makes your heart grow cold. And that's exactly what he wants. And so uh, what Christ says, and this is why what uh, Christ says and teaches and, and commands that his followers also uh, teach um, is to let forgive and let go these things, because this is what changes the world. See, this is the mentality that you are talking about, Stephen, is, ex is, is one of the biggest reasons why the world is in the condition that it's in now. There is lots of things, Stephen, that have happened to me and everybody else in the world. And if they are to hold on to all of those things, it doesn't do any good for the world. It only makes it more evil and more wicked. And I'm not trying to condemn you, Stephen. I feel, I feel bad for this experience. I feel I'm sorry that you've had this experience. And I just pray, Stephen, that the Lord will heal your heart. And Stephen, if you will forgive and let these things go and allow the Lord to come, allow the Spirit of God to come into your heart and heal your heart, He can move you forward with these things. He can help you grow forward with these things. And see, this is the, this is the, uh, one of the problems that you have with your heart and your walk with the Lord. You're not, you are holding on to these things and you get so mad and angry because of the unrighteousness and the, un, uh, the unfair things that have happened to you. Well, Stephen, the Lord God Almighty, Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ, what happened to him wasn't fair either. But he said, anybody who's to be my disciple, let him pick up his cross and follow him. Let him pick up his cross and follow me. Stephen, you have to let go of these things. Just because somebody of color did, uh, did that to you when you were younger, you know that's a planned thing from the enemy to get you exactly how you are feeling and how you are today. So, if Stephen, if you, um, uh, you, I, I think you know my email, and I'm going to, if you ever want to talk or anything, and, and nobody will... Uh, know about it, but um, I pray for healing in your heart, and and I pray that the Lord would heal the, the your heart and pour His precious. I pray that the precious blood of our Lord Yeshua Hamashiach Jesus Christ be poured over this moment, and it would heal your heart, and that you would um, be able to grow from this experience that obviously traumatized you when you were younger. You know, and me and many other people have had these experiences to, to like this, but we we forgive and we move on from them. This is how the world is healed and how the spirit of Christ and the kingdom of Christ is propagated and manifested in all the earth. Love you, Stephen. God bless you.